The hardest part is forgetting her smile. The way she laughed. The way she smelled. The way she felt. Sometimes letting go isn't as easy as leaving. Sometimes it takes a few weeks, a few months, a few years. Sometimes it lasts a lifetime. You never fully let go. Miranda, worthy of admiration. And she truly was. She truly is. In order to let go, to truly let go, you have to take the right steps. You have to get rid of all the things that remind you of them. Make new memories with new people and old places. And last but not least, you have to accept that that one person who was once your everything and whole reason of being wasn't there before, and you were fine. And you'll be fine without them now. And yeah, there will be others, but if you box yourself in, there won't be. Thanks for inviting me over to your place tonight, Gary, but I better get going. I'm sure you wouldn't like another apple martini? <laughs> no, thanks. Uh, you know, I give a mean back rub. Want me to give you one before you go? Uh, I don't know. Hey, come on, take off your shirt. I'll give you a back rub. Um, can't you just do it over my shirt? Mm, it's not the same. <laughs> I really have to get going, uh, Gary. But first, a toast. Do you like Merlot? Gary! I'm so sorry. It's all over my shirt. Well, take it off. I'll throw it in the wash. <laughs> okay. I'm leaving now. Wait, hey, I'll go with you. We can stop by Carl's Jr. and get some spicy barbecue $6 burgers to go. Actually, that sounds pretty good. They're so hot and spicy, it almost makes you want to take off your shirt. Okay, that's it. Julie, wait, where are you going? What's wrong? I... Was it the shirt thing? How does this door work? When I got close, the mercenaries... Buy some armor and, armor and live to tell about it. I may have seen the most beautiful angelic face in this entire land. I must find out her name. How oh, come I've never seen her before? You, Anuman? Why would such an ethereal creature want to sit with you on some horse? At least I have a horse. No, my good friend. To chase such a beauty, you need more than some steed to swoop her off her feet. You really are a jackass, my friend. Let's see who the fair dragonborn chooses. <laughs> Once she meets me, there really won't be a choice. I can't help it if women find me fascinating. Besides, you have plenty of women to choose from. A fair maiden like her would be a waste for a man like you. Our connection to this world extends beyond just a place to live. The nature we see, the many plants and water that give us life. And that life we get to spend with our loved ones. Every breath we release represents our energy drifting into the atmosphere of this planet. And even after we move on, the heat from our body continues to stay. This is our connection to this world. Parkour. Using your body to get from point A to point B in the most efficient way possible. This rising sport brings together the body and mind in attempting thrilling stunts. For some, parkour is merely but a hobby. However, for others, it's a way of life. Coach Vinny's love for parkour allowed him to spread his knowledge across hopeful students who also wish to practice this unique sports activity. 
Any movement involved with parkour requires prior planning and observations of the environment in order to prevent injuries. Parkour is much more than a physical sport. It's an incredible tool which nurtures freedom and creative self-expression at the most fundamental level. Would you shut up? That's the Dragonborn. Oh, shut up, you drunken fool. Excuse me, Dragonborn, won't you join us for a drink? Perhaps I could tell you my favorite story. It's about a certain Argonian maid. Dragonborn, Dragonborn, don't be afraid to join us. We don't bite. Or at least I don't. You may catch rabies from my friend here.